I found many holes near my home's <laughs> foundation. Our yard hosts chipmunks and squirrels, and I'm sure we have voles as well. Huh? Uh -huh. <laughs> Nearby are several large foundation plantings of boxwood, azaleas, and Nellie R. Stevens holly. Should I worry? If so, what can be done? Thank you, and this is Randy right here in Memphis. Let's go back to this for a second. And I'm sure I have bows. <laughs> I'm sure I have well, well, he answered his own question. Well, what do you think, John? Yeah. Oh yeah, <laughs> he sure does. And, yeah. And but you know what? He has a great environment for wildlife. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. You know, he really does. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. obviously, they're not eating any of the things that he's talking about, which is good. Okay. Now, if he starts putting in, I mean, if he starts putting in like hosta and things like that, then you know those critters are going to start eating yeah. some of those. But if if he just, if, I don't think he should be bothered by the holes unless he just doesn't <laughs> want a wildlife in his in his yard. I mean, right. get a cat, get a dog, and get a bunch know, of chicken a, snakes. <laughs> you know, they're <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah, you know? All right. yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's it's the balance of nature, really. Yeah, yeah, True. You know, you've got, I mean, voles, really. I mean, the snakes are, are harmless snakes, like the chicken snake, the king's snake. They eat those snake, things. Like, yeah, I said it all so, the time. So, you know, people are like, eh, people are like, yeah, snakes. Snakes, snakes. snakes are good. Snakes. It's the right snake in a garden, particularly, because right. they eat the vermin. Yeah. You know, so it's kind of like the balance of nature thing. Yeah, I would agree with that. You know, as long as it's not hurting his plants. I wouldn't worry about it either, but I would you know, suggest not putting in, like she said, hostas, because they'll suck them right into the ground. Yeah, I tell Nothing people all the time, voles have expensive tastes. They do. Yeah. Yeah. They're like, they're yeah. like expensive yeah. plants, that's for sure. Uh, exactly. What's the best way to get rid of voles, though? <laughs> well, I'm, yeah. I, don't, I don't know what, I don't know what maybe we should <laughs> ask me that on the side first, because I, I get aggravated at them in my yard, and mm -hmm. I don't like all those little holes. Uh, you know, and the voles. Well, she probably doesn't. Yeah, yeah the voles yeah. come in after moles have made the tunnels. Right. And then the voles get use the tunnels. And snake snakes yeah. are good, uh -huh, really uh -huh, seriously. Yeah. But if they were eating my roses, they were eating some of my mature rose roots around the crown mm -hmm. and mulch over everything is a great thing, but they use that mulch for cover. Yes, they do. And so I, I got that. so aggravated with them, I just found some rat poison yeah. and I put it down in the individual holes. And that just stopped them for a little while. Yeah. You know, it's a temporary fix. Sure. And then I would go back and fill the holes in. But it's, it's an ongoing problem. Yes, it is. You cannot eliminate yeah, them. You use, You've just got to kind of control them. Mouse traps or whatever oh, the case yeah, may no, be. You yeah. still got to mm -hmm. keep yeah, going. There's, there's, yeah. there's some a cat, traps. you yeah. know, a yeah. good mama cat that's the best hunter, you know. Mm. So, yeah. no uh, easy solution. No easy solution. No, no but the, I've had them and they were eating all of my asparagus and, and my hosta. And so I finally, you know, I, I just kept trying to keep the mulch out so it was bare in the winter. So yeah, they didn't have any it. cover, and it get reduced them. And then this year, I've had garden snakes in my in my yard, and I'm like going, "Oh yeah, good, nice and healthy. Eat those voles." Yeah. So, Garter snakes. Yeah. yeah, they're good. I see those in my yard yeah. too. So I don't, I don't, I'll leave the snakes alone. Mm -hmm. right. Yeah, I really do. do and I grow my hostas in pots. Oh, in pots. That's something yes, else. Yes, I do. Yeah, Sometimes got like you just gotta move on. We hope you enjoyed the video. We have hundreds more. To subscribe, just click below. 